Hello, welcome back to RBMCQ Bank Knowledge Booster. So let's start the first question. What is the important complication during third stage of labor? Option C, option A, postpartum hemorrhage. Option B, retention of placenta. Option C, shock. Option D, all of the above. So here the correct option is Option D, all of the above. These are the complications which can occur during third stage of labor. Next question number two. According to WHO, PPH is PPH means postpartum hemorrhage is considered following birth of the baby if the amount of blood loss is exceeds. That means become more than option share option A. 500 ml option b 1000 ml option c 1500 ml option d none of the above so here the correct option is option a 500 ml okay following the birth of the baby if the amount of blood loss is become more than 500 ml then it is considered as pph that means postpartum hemorrhage Next question number three, depending upon the amount of blood loss, PPH can be considered as measure if it is exceeds option share option A, less than 1 liter, option B, more than 1 liter, option C, more than 1.5 liter, option D, more than 2 liter. So here the correct option is option B, more than 1 liter, that means following the delivery of the baby, if the blood will lose more than 1 liter, that is considered as a major PPH. Next question number 4. If the hemorrhage occurs within 24 hours following the birth of the baby, it is known as option share option A secondary hemorrhage, option B primary hemorrhage, option C third stage hemorrhage, option D true postpartum hemorrhage. So here the correct option is option b primary hemorrhage next question number five if the bleeding occurs before expulsion of placenta it is known as option share option a secondary hemorrhage option b true postpartum hemorrhage option c third stage hemorrhage option d none of the above so here the correct option is option c third stage hemorrhage Next question number six. What is the commonest cause of PPH? Option C, option A, atonic uterus. Option B, grand multipara. Option C, over distension of uterus. Option D, prolonged labor. So here the correct option is option A, atonic uterus. Next question number seven. Obesity, that is BMI more than 35. BMI means body mass index. Previous PPH as more than 40 years, use of tocolytic drugs are the other causes of option share option A, atonic hemorrhage, option B, traumatic hemorrhage, option C, thrombin hemorrhage, option D, none of the above. So here the correct option is option A, atonic hemorrhage. Next question number 8, two rapid delivery of the baby. Preventing the uterine wall to contract rapidly, premature attempt to deliver the placenta, pulling the cord are the option share option A, mismanaged third stage of labor, option B, mismanaged second stage of labor, option C, mismanaged first stage of labor, option D, none of the above. So here the correct option is option A, mismanaged third stage of labor. Next question number nine. What is the important contributing factors of maternal death in PPH? Options are option A, malnutrition, option B, anemia, option C, inadequate antenatal care, option D, all of the above. So here the correct option is option D, all of the above. In addition to that, internatal care, lack of blood transfusion facilities, substandard care, etc. are also important contributing factors of maternal death in PPH. PPH means postpartum hemorrhage. Next question number 10. Uterus massage to make it hard and express the blood clot. 
Injection methods in 0.2 mg IV and injection oxytocin 10 units in 500 ml of normal cell and at the rate of 40 to 60 drops per minute are the actual management of option share option A atonic uterus, option B traumatic uterus, option C retain tissues, option D coagulopathy. So here the correct option is option A atonic uterus. Next question number 11. What is the cause of late postpartum hemorrhage? Option share option A. Retain beach of cotyledon. Option B. Infection. Option C. Sub-involution of the placental site. Option D. All of the above. So here the correct option is. Option D. All of the above. Next question number 12. What is the full management protocol for major PPH? Option C option A communication, option B resuscitation, option C monitoring and investigations, option D all of the above. So here the correct option is option D all of the above. Next question number 13. What is an extremely rare but a life threatening complication in the third stage of labor in which the uterus is turned inside out partially or completely? Option C option A atonic uterus. Option B infarction of the uterus. Option C both A and B. Option D none of the A above. So here the correct option is Option B infarction of the uterus. Next question number 14. What is the common risk factors of infarction of the uterus? Option C option A manual removal of placenta. Option B, short umbilical cord. Option C, uterine malformations. Option D, all of the above. So here the correct option is Option D, all of the above. Next question number 15. What type of uterus is found in traumatic hemorrhage? Option C, option A, well contracted. Option B, flabby. Option C, become hard on massaging. Option D, none of the above. So here the correct option is Option A, well contracted. Please check out MCQ on treatment of infertility.